working of a Mac person stuff, its advantages and disadvantages are actually discussed in this topic. So, uh, as you know, Mac person stuff was developed by Mr. Uh, Errol S. Mac person uh, of uh, General Motors uh, in the year 1947. It is actually a combination of uh, a shock absorber and a coil spring uh, as a single unit. So we can see how a Mac person stud reacts when it enters a hump uh, or a projection over here. So uh, one of the advantage of Mac person stud is that uh, its simplicity and low maintenance, and that's why it's been widely used in cars, m mainly in European cars, like the high-end cars like Porsche, Mercedes-Benz, and BMW actually uh, employs the Mac person stud. Uh, now let's identify its components. Uh, the Mac person stud is actually shown here in violet color uh, inside the spring. So this is the Mac person stud over here. This is the left hand side one and this is right hand side one. And we have these springs over it. That's a shock absorber uh, spring. Okay. Now uh, this is the stabilizer bar. This whole unit is a stabilizer bar which keeps the front tires stabilized. Uh, here we have the uh, steering link over here and uh, the green one on both sides are the tie rods. So you can see how when a uh, vehicle moves how the uh, tires react with the Mac person stud and its shock absorber as it enters a projection. And the disadvantage is uh, that it cannot allow vertical movement of the wheels without some degree of camber. That means when the Mac person stud is employed, the tire enters uh, a hump. You can see the right uh, tire is entering a hump and the wheels are actually moving inside. A camber angle has been created. The wheel cannot move vertically up uh, simply and directly. It actually tends to move inside a bit and creates a camber angle. That's the same happening on the left hand side also and at the right hand side. You can see it enters a hump on both the sides and the uh, both the right hand side and the left hand side wheels create a camber angle uh, thereby uh, the vertical movement of the Mac person stud is uh, established and also uh, there is another difficulty of uh, sound it transmits noise and vibrations from uh, actually from the rod directly to the body shell uh, so avoiding for avoiding this noise reduction and isolation mechanisms need to be employed on uh, vehicles which have uh, uh, this Mac person stud. So I believe you got an idea about the Mac person stud. So for more videos, please subscribe to us and please rate us by dropping a comment or uh, clicking the like button. Thanks for watching this video.